Hi guys, today I'm going to show you very quickly how to upload an assignment to Schoology. Many of you will take courses that require you to upload essays, homework assignments, sometimes even video recording, and today I'm going to show you how to go through that process. So the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to go to Courses, which is up here in this corner, and I'm going to select the course for which I have the assignment. So I'm scroll down to my class. I am a student right there. All right, now here, this is the homework assignment that I am required to do, homework one. Now, if this is a clickable assignment, what I'm going to do is I'm going to click this assignment and it's going to take me to my upload screen. So if you look here, there is a little heading called submissions and underneath submissions is a button that says submit assignment and that's what we're going to be doing today. So left click that button all right and as it loads I'm going to give you guys three different ways that you can upload an assignment or submit an assignment through this all right the first one is very easy it's the upload function for those of you that have Facebook or any other type of social media where you upload pictures or things like that this process is very very similar so you have a couple of options first you can upload a file so if I click this file button it's going to take me to my filing cabinet inside my computer and I can go through and I can select all right if this is my assignment I'll click this and then I'll press OK but this isn't my assignment so what I'm going to do I'm going to cancel that because that's not what I want to upload but if that was the essay that I have or the homework assignment that I have that would be I would press OK I, I can also upload an audio or a video recording and I can do this directly onto my computer or even my cell phone. I also down here take a look where it says add a comment. Add a comment is not the place to copy and paste your assignment. All right? This section is for little notes that you might have for the teacher explanations. For example, if this is my first draft, I might type, teacher, this is my first draft. So that way the teacher knows Yes, I'm submitting my assignment, but I might have another copy in the future. So that's the upload function, one way. The second way is to hit the Create button. Now, here on the Create button, you can type your assignment into Schoology, and it will save it in Schoology. So you don't have to have Microsoft Word. You don't have to have Pages or any other word processing software. You can simply type your response into this little box right here. Now, the problem especially for those who are submitting essays and things that require very specific formatting is that the formatting is not saved. So for those of you who have instructors that require double space, you don't have that option here. It won't save. Page numbers won't save. It does give you a few options. You can bold and italic and underline your text as well as left justify, center, and right justify. But more complex things, you probably need to stick with Word and the upload function. But if you have a short response, maybe a paragraph, this would be a good place to save your document. Also, if you look down here, you can see where it says Save Draft. Now, if you click Save Draft, that is going to save what you have written. It is not going to submit the assignment to the instructor. This is a very good function for you to have if you are working on a computer that is not yours, if you are working on a computer that has a tendency to have the internet cut out or if it's raining outside and you're afraid the power might go out. This way you can automatically save your assignment on Schoology so even if something else happens, whoops, you still have that option of keeping it there. At the end, you also need to hit submit. That will submit the assignment to the teacher. If you just hit save draft, the teacher is not going to be able to see your assignment. All right, the next and the final thing is your resources. Now you should have a resources button at the very top of your screen. Sometimes you can put files there like essays or old assignments that you want to save. You can attach a resource, like for example, I have a I have a document right here and this could be my assignment and if this is my assignment I can simply click press import and then that is going to submit as my response all right but that's a little more complex and requires a little more practice with Schoology all right so to review 
Upload, Create, Resources. Upload just like Facebook. Create, you can do it on Schoology, but you do have to save and submit. And Resources will keep your ideas, your works in the cloud so that you don't have to have it on a flash drive or on an actual physical computer. All right. I hope this is really helpful and I hope that you will have a good time uploading your assignments correctly to Schoology. If you have any questions, any comments, just let me know in the comments below and either myself or another teacher will be more than happy to help. Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you in my next how-to video.